All right, once again, Barnes Al Hutton team. All right, here we have the Smith & Wesson Bodyguard 380. We're going to do a quick review of it. We had a lot of requests from our subscribers to do a quick review of the Smith & Wesson Bodyguard 380. First off, it comes in this little box. All right, so I'll open up the box. It comes in this carry pouch. It also comes with the lock. Of course, the key to the lock. All your paperwork. And it also comes with this little tool for adjusting your laser, to line your laser sights up. So we're going to get this stuff out of the way. We're going to set this off to the side. And then we're going to open it up. All right. Spit the whistle bodyguard. Okay. It comes with one six-round magazine. So it's a six plus one capacity. All right. Just so you see how it fits. When you place it in your side, you see your pinky is still hanging off the bottom so you don't have a full grip and for the left-handed shooters it has the laser button on the left side so you can put the laser on flip it turn it off with your trigger finger all right for you right-handed shooters buttons on the right side so the laser beam is ambidextrous okay so we're going to show you how it comes apart all right as always as you see in the beginning it's an empty gun so let's get a little close-up view of the Smith & Wesson bodyguard. All right, now we're going to show you how it comes apart. Okay. First, we're going to change camera angles so you can get a better look at how it comes apart. All right, first off, we're going to show you how it comes apart along with all the controls. Here you have your thumb safety. All right, it keeps the slide from going back. It also disengages your trigger. All right, here you have your slide stop. So when you put your slide back, a little problem there, you lock your slide to the rear. You also release your slide. All right, now here's how it comes apart. You want to lock the slide to the rear. You want to push this little pin as far forward as you can get it. Sometimes it can be a pain. It gets a little tight when you first try to use, a, use this weapon. All right, and you make sure you ride the slide slowly so it doesn't fly off and bring it off slowly. Okay, inside here, you unscrew this to take this plate off. This is how you get to your laser if you need to change the battery or if you need to get the laser replaced. All right, the, it's called an Insight Laser. It's the brand name of the lasers, Insight. Here, you have your adjusting screw for your laser beam. So you can make sure your laser beam is on target, lined up with your bow. You know, you want to sight in your laser, here's your adjustment screw to bring it up, bring it down. All right. Inside you have your, your spring. Okay, your bow's very, very small. All right, easy to come apart. All right, you don't need to break it down any further than that. And to put it back together, you just reverse the procedure. Make sure everything's lined up. Slide it on. Lock your slide to the rear. And your pin, when you put it back, you make sure the same way it came out, which is all the way over, line it up. Okay. Now, make sure you slide it all the way over. And then you check, make sure it functions. All right. It has a tight trigger pull. All right. But it'll take a little time to get used to. But for the most part, that's how it comes apart. It's fairly easy. Except you may have a little hard time here with your, your pin here. But other than that, it's fairly easy to come apart. And it's nice and compact. Like I said, ambidextrous laser. So if you got right-handed shooters, push with your trigger finger. Left-handed shooters, push with your trigger finger. All right, so it's ambidextrous laser. It's a pretty good gun for the money. Like I said, it's been sitting in the box for about four years. But, you know, we're going to take it out, shoot, and let you know how it is. All right. This is a this is a mere's target. He's all over the place. All right, with the car 380. Now it's gonna be my turn to try it. Bodyguard 
see how this came out. Not bad, not bad. Alright. Alright. So, this is our review of Western Bodyguard 380. So, let's come back, we'll do it again. Alright, we out.